Hi. Today we are looking at this roll of filament from Polymaker, the Polylite PLA. So let's get started. Today we are finally looking at the Polylite PLA from Polymaker. As you have seen in the time lapses, I've printed several models with this PLA. All links to the downloads of these models are available in the video description below. Looking over all these models, they came out very nice in general. I will go over them one by one now. All models are printed with a layer height of 115 micron and a temperature of 195 degrees. The first model here we have the 3D Benji. There is no stringing in the model at all, and it's printed very nicely. The first layer is not great, but this is actually caused by my printer. At the rooftop there is a bit of under extrusion here, and in some places, but in general, the Drupal Benchy came out really nice. The second print is this Adelinda, and, it, and like the 3D Benchy, it came out great as well. As you can see below the wings here, it has a bit of problem, but I won't blame the filament for that. The third model is this platform jack. With this module I actually had three failures before it printed correctly. And this probably was caused by the printing speed. After I changed the printing speed to a slower speed, it came out very well. As you can see here, there are three layer shifts. And that's actually the problem. Once it printed correctly, it had a bit of problem with, with the bridging. But as you can see here, it worked out okay. And the model works perfectly fine, like you can see.
I also wanted to print something nice in face mode. So here it is. It came out great and it's kind of bad it's grey because it doesn't fit within my living room now or with most flowers. Of course we also needed to print a great model from Floalistic and especially lower low poly ones. So here it is. Scaled up to 150% making it a nice and long print. Below the cheek there are a bit of stringing because it's a problem with, with the overhangs. But besides that it came out great. And this model and the next one was printed a bit later as the rest. I decided to use Prusa control instead of strict 3 r As you can see it worked out perfectly. The very last model is a model suggested by Polymaker itself on Twitter. It's a torture test and like every other model it worked very great. Nearly everything was, per was printed perfectly. And I will post some photos on uh, my website as you can see there. So basically there's only one thing I can say about the Polylite PLA and that is it's printed perfectly. Especially for the price it's currently sold at. It is a great filament. You can buy the Polylite PLA from Amazon for around $25. Please note that I received this roll of filament directly from Polymaker free of charge for this review. Thank you for watching. See you next time.